like this is like every night it's like but like fifty times five hours later. <laughs> there is more? I went to the Dickie Harvey concert in Sounds Nightclub in LA and let me tell you what, it was awesome. I went with any expectation because I really don't know who is DJ Harvey and actually it's not that popular but apparently it's really important in the techno music, in the underground and yeah, it's been a big movement in the industry, apparently. I went just because my gringo friend, the one who introduced me in this world of techno Tell me that if he just gonna see one DJ set for the rest of his life, he gonna be probably DJ Harvey. The, those are extreme words for him to say. We are talking about we saw together Disclosure and it was a fantastic set. I saw with him Jamie XX and it just blow my mind. And he keeps saying that this one is the best DJ set that you're gonna see. So I just bought the tickets, I just went and it was the biggest surprise I ever had. Starting with the venue, the venue was just amazing. The name of the venue, how I say in the beginning, is Sounds Nightclub. It's located in Hollywood. It's kind of hide it. I never see it. If you pass by, you will never know that that's a great venue because it's all black. And yeah, as soon as you get in, you can see the bar. You can see the red lights all around. A lot of sculptures of animals, gears in the wall. And yeah, the staff are really nice. At least when I arrive, I arrive super early. We arrive like at 10. And when we arrive, there were no one. There were no one. I get this amazing video where you can see everything, the dance floor, the one who are to the left and in the, and in the right, they supposed to be like private tables, but really you need to go to those sections to go to the restroom so they're not that private behind the booths behind the dj they they are another section and that was like the biggest uh vip section that i ever seen it just looks so good the dance floor is just so good you just can see it there is open there is why you have speakers behind up and in front of you the lights, how they move, it's amazing. In the middle of the set, the lights that are in the ceiling with the candles, like they just start moving up and down and they change color. And yeah, it was just an amazing experience just to see it, just to feel it. And everything was a big surprise for me. I never been to this venue before. Another surprise is exactly above the DJs, exactly above the booth. You can see the disco shark. I don't know how important is the disco shark. I don't know if you can always see it, but the only time that I saw the disco shark was when I went to Coachella in one of the stages called Yuma. That's the only way where you, when I see the disco shark. And yeah, it's, it's just come back. Those memories when I went to Coachella, it was a big surprise. No one noticed that the disco shark was in Coachella. And yeah, you can just see it. It was amazing. The triangle that, that is around the shark it started lighting up with different pattern, with different colors. And yeah, like it just feel amazing. Hopefully I can see it again this year in Coachella. Now, talking about the ones who opened from DJ Harvey, God Dollar and Paradise. Those two DJs, they are the ones who open. They play about one hour and a half, maybe two hours. As soon as we go in, that we are one of the first ones, they were already playing and they were like killing it, killing it. They don't give a fuck if there was no one there in the dance floor, which is something that I really appreciate. The most crazy stuff that you see, it's under set. Under set, the lights start moving, the shark disco light up, and the, the lights go crazy, which is something to help a lot to the DJ set that they play. With DJ Harvey, with DJ Harvey is different. 
With DJ Harvey, I was already so tired that I don't even know when he go in, but when he start playing, you know that he's there. <laughs> is the most absurd DJ set that I ever heard. You can hear some of their music, some of their sounds. Unfortunately, I went there for DJ Harvey and it was so good that I forgot to record. I forgot to record more of their set. I just was enjoy. I was just in the moment. He switched between dance music and Chicago Acid, which was super weird. And it's because I never were here Chicago Acid before, but it's something that I, that I already know that exists. It's something that I want to experience. And I'm so glad that he played. I'm so glad that now I know how it feels and how it sounds. I wanna feel it again. I wanna enjoy that again. And again, I know I repeat this a lot, but it was an amazing experience. And I repeat it because it's that. Everything surround that concert was awesome. The people who went there, that we should talk about that. The audience, the audience who went, I don't know if it's the audience who went to the Sounds nightclub or the ones who go to DJ Harvey, but they were amazing. Sometimes the people forgot that that's one of the biggest problem in the parties, in the concert. The audience, sometimes they're just bad. It's just horrible. They are fighting. They are too high. They make you uncomfortable. But this audience was amazing. They don't fight. They weren't too high. They were just enjoying with you. And that's amazing. No one look you bad. Everyone is happy. Everyone is just enjoying. And that's exactly what you want to see in any concert. So definitely. If you can see DJ Harvey, go and see it because he is awesome. You're gonna have an amazing experience. It doesn't matter if you see it in Sounds Nightclub or, or in any other uh, venue because he gonna blow your mind. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and see you next time.